Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am currently at the high school waiting to pick Olivia up. Um, I'm several cars behind to where they're um, being picked up at. There's a line. Um, I do take her in the mornings and pick her up. They're on rotation where they go every other day. She was super nervous. I don't know if anybody else deals with this with their teen when they're starting high school, but she makes herself so upset and gets so worked up that she literally gets sick. And it makes me so, so sad. But she made it through. I can't wait to hear how her day was. She doesn't like to be on camera, so we're going to respect that. And yeah, um, I'm just going to let her get in the car. We're going to go get something to eat, whatever she's hungry for. And then I need to go to the grocery store and get some groceries. I am off from my essential job today. And I just pulled up here at the school from taking Bay to work. He went a little early so I could be here on time to pick up our precious daughter. So, little... Um, my queen is going to get in the car, we're going to go get a bite, and then in the next clip you will probably see me getting groceries or some grocery items because I need to cook dinner tonight. So I will see you in the next clip. Hi you guys, we made it to the grocery store. I decided to come to pick and save. Um, if they have great buys, it's right by where we live, uh, because babe has to be at work very soon and we need groceries really bad. Uh, it is the next day though. And I want to apologize for that. I was so tired, um, yesterday from working at my essential job and staying over late because the, we don't have a third shift worker right now. All those nights staying over late and then getting up early and taking my precious daughter to school. I was just so sleepy and tired. I had, we, I went and got gas, got Olivia something to eat yesterday after school. She wanted Burger King. And then, uh, we, we got made at home. I fixed me some chili. She ate and then we both like slept for so long. So, it is now the next day. It is Tuesday, November the 10th, and we're going to come, we're going to go and pick and save and get some groceries, and I'll do a grocery haul for you guys when I make it home, okay? Okay, you guys, so I'm back home now. I've been home for a few hours. We had to get the groceries in. Babe had to leave for work. Um, What else? I had a granola bar because I hadn't eaten all day and I still need to cook dinner for me and Olivia and also we opened a few of these groceries I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul for you guys uh, like the box of granola bars um, babe opened a few things so he could take to work and yeah so let me show you everything I got from pick and save for our family it was like a hundred it rounded out to be around a hundred dollars so this is what I got okay so over here we got these chocolate chip we love the mini muffins and this time we got the chocolate chip they have birthday cake and they also have blueberry and it's good to take in Olivia's lunches for school two paper towels look at this cat she's hanging on the table Look over that over there. That's dirty laundry. I have to get to wash at the laundry mat. Um, two cans of chili. These a few of these soda drinks. Parmesan cheese, grated parmesan for spaghetti, bacon bits for a salad. We use real bacon bits. Olivia and her daddy use the Thousand Island for their salads. Bagels to I make sandwiches with my bagels, popcorn, um, bread and buns, chocolate, dark chocolate chunk, granola bars, 
Um, that's also good for all of us on our lunch breaks at work and school. The sauce for the spaghetti I'm using is this tomato, garlic, and onion. Two of these frozen meals just in case Olivia needs to whip something up while me and her dad are at work. Cat food, and then I got the soft cat food that's over there. A bag of chips. We were out of ketchup. Actually, this is the party bag. Um, all of her, fa all of our favorites are there. The noodles I'm going to use for the spaghetti. Um, croutons. We get the garlic and butter croutons for our salads. And then I had to put the ice cream in the freezer. Um, Olivia's been wanting ice cream, and I've kind of been craving ice cream too. So I got ice cream sandwiches. And then these are like um, sausage, egg, and cheese croissants I got. And that was like one of the first things my daughter opened. She just loves them. Okay, and look, my refrigerator is clean. How exciting. So, I got some eggs. This is stuff I needed to go ahead and put in the refrigerator. Um, The Carving Board Chicken Breast by Oscar Mayer is so good, you guys. A can of biscuits. Um, the butter, We get the buttermilk. I don't like the flaky. Um, We got these... Uh, square cheeses, the marble jack cheese, and the mild shredded cheese. Two things of lettuce for salads. I might need to, probably should freeze one. Um, chicken salad, club crackers, and the hamburger meat is in here. And I think that's everything we got. Oh, and I got a thing of water. It is in here in my living room by the door. I need to bring that in here. That water right there. And I need to go ahead and put up these in the freezer. And this, uh, my camera, I need a new charger because it is not charging good at all. I'm going to put it on the charger really quick, but that's everything I got. I'm going to put this away, and I will see y'all in a bit. Okay, so now I'm getting ready to put this hamburger meat. We get the ground chuck on the skillet to cook it for my and my daughter's spaghetti tonight. That's what we're having because this is one of her favorite meals. And she did so good at school yesterday. I'm so proud of her. And I've been wanting to put one of her favorite meals. And I love it too. And there will always be some for when her when Babe gets home from work. Or if he wants to come by on his lunch break. Because they get like 30 minutes. He always can. He knows that. Um... So this is, I'm just using a regular skillet and spatula. And move, Natalie, you can't be by the stove, baby. You gotta come over here. She loves when I'm up here. She's such a curious cat, you guys. So I'm just putting that in the skillet and then I'm gonna get a pot. I'm gonna try to find a pot. I mean, see if I have a pot down here to boil the spaghetti noodles. I was hoping I may have to, oh yeah, here's one right here, this one. So um, I just need to put some water in it. I have a ton of dishes I need to get washed and put, let me see if this is better lighting because it, it gets dark, yeah, that's better. It gets dark so early now, and here in Alabama, um, it's been like 70, between 70 and 75 degrees and humid, but today it's been raining, and tomorrow we're supposed to get some really bad thunderstorms, and I think it's from the hurricane that I've seen over in Florida. Usually we'll get really bad thunderstorms from that. And so I'm just turning my 
right eye on um, between eight and high to boil the spaghetti noodles. Um, this is the these were on sale at Pig and Save for eighty cents. Um, it used to be a Piggly Wiggly, and then it turned all the Piggly Wigglies changed to Pig and Save here, and. They have some really good buys, and it's just right up the road because I was in a hurry. And the reason y'all can't really see what I'm doing here is because I have a short cord that's charging. Let's see if that's better. Oh, yeah. That's better. Okay, so, well, the rooster's in the way. I have a rooster that's holding my, um, like, spatulas and stuff. Okay, there we go. So we're gonna follow about those angles. We're gonna scramble this meat, then we're gonna drain the grease. And let these noodles boil once I get them in the pot. Because we are hungry. When I tell you we're hungry, we're hungry and there's so many other meals I want to cook and make, but there's only certain times of the week that I can do it because I'm on second shift at my essential job, which I could always prepare some things and make it before I go to work. That way, Olivia and her daddy will have it. And I need to start prepping um for what I want to get and have for Thanksgiving. I usually cook on Thanksgiving, but if we're open that day, it's sliding. I'm going to have to work. And, well, we might not be open Thanksgiving Day, but we are. Then again, I think we are. I hope we're not. I don't know. I wasn't there last Thanksgiving. I didn't start till like February of 2020 where I'm at right now. And I don't think convenience stores close on Thanksgiving. I mean, we didn't even close on Easter. So, yeah. Um, but I will still have part of my day, uh, which will be great. And I need to go to the grocery store and prep for, and usually we don't use this, we use half of one of these. I need to prep and get what I want to have. What I usually cook for Thanksgiving is, uh, I make dressing, chicken and dressing. It turns out so good. It's so good. I've made it many, many Thanksgiving. Last Thanksgiving, I did not cook. We went to like this buffet place and ate. It was, it was good, but it's not like having it at home. I do like corn dressing. What else do I do? Um, turkey, sweet potato casserole. Oh, I mean, I just, uh, oops. There y'all went. I usually have like a pies. Uh, usually the pies are store bought. What's wrong? I think that's going to be enough noodles for me and Olivia. Well, who else is excited for Thanksgiving? And let me know what you guys do on Thanksgiving um, and everything in the comments below. I'm going to put these in here, and I am going to let this finish cooking, because then it's going to take a while for these noodles to, um, I need to add a little more water. I need some more. I need some more uh, pots and pans so bad. And I'm going to gotta finish getting those groceries put away. So, I want 
I'm doing a lot at one time, but that's okay. I'll see you guys in a bit, probably um, when all this is done. And then I'll show you how it looks. And I'm going to put all these. Well, actually, let's see. The chili, the canned chili goes up in this cabinet up here. And I already have my corn and my mac. Oh, we have corn mac and cheese on Thanksgiving also. Um, we were out of, I was completely out of ketchup. So I went ahead and grabbed another thing of ketchup. Because I like, sometimes I like ketchup. Whenever we have like bacon, egg, and cheese biscuits, I love putting ketchup on it sometimes for some reason. It's so yummy. So I need this and I need this because we're going to do Parmesan cheese and spaghetti sauce for spaghetti. Um, I need to put these drinks in the fridge. And that is just some mail. Oh, I need to check the mailbox. My Etsy package may be in the mail. I need to go check and see. Bananas. I don't, I think I forgot to show y'all. I got bananas. Yeah, the refrigerator looks so much better now. I'm going to fix this some sweet tea. Um, the cat food can go over here for right now. It's the I got a salmon flavor, and I also got this new one. It's Meow Mix Seafood Medley. I think she'll like that. And another thing of wet food. My cats love the wet food and the hard food. I like it. The wet food is like a treat for my cats because I don't buy it that often because they really, really, really do go with the hard food. Um, and then these bagels, I'm going to make sandwiches. And um, granola bars can go up here. I got hot chocolate up here still. <laughs> it's supposed to turn cold after that thunderstorm we get tomorrow. The bacon bits, the thousand islands. I'm going to drain the grease. I'm going to do that now, actually, and over here. Um, I have a little 
thing I put the grease in and then I'm going to drain the water out of the noodles after I drain the grease. That's what I'm doing now. Nothing too interesting. And then after I drain the water out of the noodles, I'm going to open the sauce and the grated parm. And we're just going to dip however much out we need onto our plates, our bowls. Instead, we like doing it like that instead of mixing it all together so that we, you know, we don't want to over, I don't know, we just like doing it like that because that way you know how much Parmesan you're getting, how much sauce you're getting, how much meat you're getting, how much noodles you're getting, and that's just what, what's work, what works for us. I can't speak. And then I hope you guys enjoyed the grocery. Now I'm just getting the water, draining the water out of the noodles. I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul and kind of like day in the life type video. Um, if y'all want to see like a cleaning video let me know now i'm just opening the parmesan because um i gotta do some major like cleaning like dishes pick up in the living room stuff like that and my pumpkin already went bad we had to throw it out it started falling, caving in, but I still have two more pumpkins because I thought my daughter wanted to carve, but she has yet to do it. Um, so this is open. Now I need to open the sauce. The sauce is all, okay, got that open. So yeah, if y'all want to see a cleaning video just let me know that's probably gonna come next possibly uh if i don't get to it tonight i will definitely do it tomorrow because after tomorrow i go back to work on thursday at my essential job i want to thank you guys so much for watching i'll take a picture of my plate for the thumbnail after I get it fixed and I love you guys so much if you like this video please give it a thumbs up please subscribe and I will see y'all in my next one bye guys